Hello, this is Camilla Vaughn. And Gabby Price. First off, we will discuss Marco Rubio's campaign that was just released. It is his first televised ad. It focuses on the Paris attacks and the issues of natural, national security. He says, and I quote, What happened in Paris could happen here. There is no middle ground. The context of this ad is binary choice, is a binary choice of us or them. This relates to candidates trying to set the political agenda. And then in political socialization news, government, uh, Governor John Kasich has criticized Donald Trump for campaigning in Ohio. He says that Donald Trump is an entertainer and is dividing the political party. The super PAC supporting him, New Day of America, has released an attack ad uh, recounting Donald Trump's greatest hits. Donald Trump tweeted, Going to Ohio, home of one of the worst presidential candidates in history, Kasich, can't debate loves hashtag Obamacare dummy. To conclude our national news stories, we end with the infamous Donald Trump. Donald Trump was, on, was hosting SNL this month on November 7th. Because of the equal, equal time rule, some of his Republican rivals complained about not receiving equal airtime. However, this does not mean that on an upcoming episode of SNL, it will be hosted by one of the Republican candidates, nor will there be a cameo. What this does mean is that there will be commercial and promotional, pr promotional oh, airtime time. in primetime this weekend, including during Saturday Night Live. Still at the negotiating meeting, table at George E. Pataki, the former For governor of New York, who also fail, filed. filed a complaint requesting equal airtime. In local news, a 15-year-old pedestrian, pedestrian that has not, has not been identified at this time was struck at approximately 8 p.m. on Venice Boulevard near Hughes and Clarington Avenues in Palms. This was a hit and run situation in which the political department, police department, police department is offering a $50,000 reward on any information on the hit and run. So far, what is known is the car was a maroon 2001 Buick La Sabra, license plate number 7KWC773. For our, our op-ed editorial, Written by Alan, Alan Rappaport, Rappaport, titled Ben Carson Clarifies Remarks on Muslim, Muslims Celebrating on 9-11. This was published November 23, 2015. This article comes from the New York Times. The article talks about Donald Trump and Ben Carson saying that they saw Muslims in New Jersey celebrating when they saw the World Trade, Trade Center fall on September 11, 2001. Their sources come from a film, film. 